Hi everyone, thank you so much for jumping back on my channel and checking my videos out. Today what I want to do is I want to talk to you about reviews. <laughs> reviews are so important, I keep on saying this, um, because they're so important, because they um, create our bookings, because they make us look good, because our reviews is everything to us. Our reviews, to me personally, my reviews are like... A heartbeat to me so they're super super important if you are not subscribed to my channel I would greatly appreciate it if you can subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button to continue um, learning more about Airbnb business um, what I want to do today is I want to talk about Airbnb reviews how I get them how I communicate with my guests and what I tell them when I'm leaving them review and um, just an idea how I get my five-star reviews on my Airbnb let's get started so basically again what I do is I provide five-star place with everything that you can possibly think of that a guest will basically need all the necessities um, all the comfort with comfortable couches comfortable bed and I know I provide a five-star um, everything for my guests again if a guest moves in what i do first is i ask them how everything went and i try to communicate with them in between of the stay and on their move out day i ask them if ever anything is needed and when they check out i go in and i check the unit out if the unit is in good condition what i do like the first thing like the first thing i do is i text them right away i'm like hey thank you so much for leaving my place super clean what i'm going to do is i'm leaving you a five star review you are an amazing guest i am like super excited that you stayed with us thank you thank you so much and i'm just leaving you an awesome five star review thank you for being a great guest so what do i do in this situation <laughs> I leave my guest no option but to leave me a five-star review because they know in their mind that I'm leaving them a five-star review. So it's kind of not fair when a host tells you, hey, I'm leaving you five-star review, you're an awesome guest, and uh, they end up not um, leaving you a five-star, you know what I mean? So it's kind of like a psychology plane here. So with all of my guests, um, I started doing that and I see how great it works. And again, I do go and I leave them a great, great review. And um, even if they left my place, not like really trashed, bad trash, but like kind of dirty that I would leave them a four star review or something like that. I still prefer to tell them that I will leave them a five-star review and I do leave them a five-star review with just a comment that um, it was a bit dirty but no big deal in the comments so other host knows that the guest is a bit dirty but um, no big deal again uh, everything's perfectly fine with the guests they're amazing so um, basically this is how I run my reviews this is how I get my five-star reviews and um, I absolutely love how guests leave me like big awesome reviews and I hope one of the days I'll do like a little screenshots or something of um, of my five star um, reviews and how awesome guests write those reviews to me it's always like touching and I'm like oh this is why I do this business <laughs> I absolutely love satisfying my guests I absolutely love communicating with my guests and um it makes me happy. It makes me happy to see my guests enjoy my properties because this is what I strive to do. And I hope you can do the same, guys. And uh, from now on, on you're going to start getting five-star reviews. And you don't have to have a super-duper expensive mattress. If a guest checked in and when you're communicating with them, you see that they like the place and they're like, oh, everything's great, blah, blah, blah. Just, be, just at the end of when they check out, just text them. It takes you like five seconds, but you're going to get that five-star review. I hope this helped you to get your five-star reviews and um, good luck with your business.